good morning it's really early um i'm just gonna wind myself before i do the school run today so what was what was i last week can't even remember now what was i Was I 15-3? I was 15-3, wasn't I? I was 15. Hang on a minute. Morning. I was 15-4. I was 15-7. I lost three pounds, didn't I? Excuse my roof. I'm trying to prop my phone up, but I want it like this. But it's dropping. Do you want me to hold it? No, I'm all right. I can't get up the wall. I can. Just taking my shoes off. So, I was 15-4. It's too much to be in the 14s, isn't it? Right. I'm gonna press the start button. You wait. Ready? Fourteen thirteen. Let me hold it. I'll show you. Fourteen thirteen and a half. I'll take that. I'll take that. Yes, I'm in the four. I'm in the fourteen. Jeez. Well, I'm in the fourteen. Oh. <laughs> yeah. Happy? Are you happy? Yeah. Don't care. Excuse my trashy garden. I'm in the fourteens. Four and a half pounds. Happy with that? Well, happy with that. Four and a half pounds. I'll take that. Yeah. So, as you know, I'm 14 stone 13 and maybe three quarters, but who cares? It starts with a 14. It doesn't start with a 15. I'm really happy. I think the reason that I've lost four, I'm really shocked because normally I sort of lose two or like two and a half, three, two, probably two and a half is my average when I did it before. I think this time I've obviously got four kids, um, Jonathan He's normally at work or something. And obviously, I'm a consultant this time because I've joined, uh, you know, I'm doing it. So, and I honestly do not stop, as you might have seen from my videos. Um, most days, I um, take the kids, get up, take the kids to school, um, get back. I'll do some clients, get some stuff ready, or got some stocking, or I'm doing some cleaning or putting something away. Um, and then, you know, however many clients I've got throughout the day, me and the baby are in and out of the car, in and out of everyone's house. And I pick the kids up from school. Like, Monday, my daughter has tutoring. Tuesday, we have swimming. Um, I have deliveries Tuesday night as well. Wednesday, I'm really busy, all the things, um, people again. And on the Sundays is football, then loads of clients on a Sunday as well. So... I get a couple of days where I don't do much and I'm probably doing sort of cleaning or tidying then. So I don't stop and I don't know if I'm just using a bit more energy than I normally do. I'm not moaning about the energy um, that I'm using because it's good. So I do feel like I'm here, there and everywhere all of the time. So I don't know if I'm just using a, a bit more calories or energy than I normally would. Because I've had a few wicked losses and I, obviously I'm not complaining at all. I'm really happy. Um, but yeah, that's where I am. So, two stone five pounds since the 6th of September. And it's now the 8th of November. So, I think it's nine weeks on plan. But I had one week off for my birthday, didn't I? So, I had a one week gain. So... Nine weeks, two and a half stone. Can't cope with, can't cope. Can't moan about that. I can cope. Can't moan about that. My target was to be in the, um, look at my hair. It's really greasy. Sorry. There's nothing I can do with it today to make it better. I should have just shoved it up. Um, I wanted to be in the 14s for Christmas. Well, Christmas is in what? Six weeks? I could even get into the 13s, you know, if I'm all right. I'd be buzzing with that, like literally buzzing. My target, it's usually 11 and a half, but sometimes 
it might be too low. Um, so I might aim for 12. But if I got into 13 something for Christmas, my target's only one stone point down. So I'm so happy. I've got my top back on. I've got my, uh, I feel thinner in this as well. My Cambridge top on. Um, yeah. I've had a banoffee bar. I had a banoffee bar and I was on the phone to a client this morning. So I didn't record it. I've had the boiler man in this morning and a few clients. Got my boiler serviced. So that's something else out of the way. Um, I've got a team lunch with work on the 25th of November. And my best friend's birthday on the 25th of November. Jonathan's birthday is on the 30th of November. So... With my birthday, I obviously ended up having a week off. If if I do something with my friends, I think that the fact that I'm in the 14s, I'm going to be really low 14s by then. So um, with work, I'll have I'll have a step two day. I'll have like a chicken salad um, with my friend. I don't know what I'm doing if we, if we go out. I'll just do chicken salad or steak salad or something. Um, so I've got a few things coming up at the end of November. But obviously, going into Christmas, I know I'm going to be relaxing anyway. But if I can get into the 13s, no, not if I will get into the 13s, I will. Because I'm on it now. I'm so happy. Um, yeah, I'm excited. I feel it. I feel like I've got a bit of a waist. Um, I feel like my waist is cut. Like, I don't feel like a big, round, fat snowman when I look in the mirror. That's what I felt like. You know that hippo? You know the hippo... Um, You know what I do? I'll see if I can put a hippo on this video. I might not be able to, so don't bank on it. But you know the, the hippo with the ballerina skirt that does this dancing? That's what I felt like. I just felt like a big, fat, round lump. And I feel like I've got a shape back. I feel like I'm getting a shape. I've got hips and a waist. Um, so I just feel, oh yeah, I feel good today, actually. There we go, anyway. Hope everyone's having a good day. Um, I got yeah, I had three people in this morning as well. Two pound off. I got another two pound off. Got four pound off. No, and I got a five pound off. So I've got loads of good offs this morning. I went a seven pound off, and then I got my four, didn't I? So everyone's had a really good week. Um, coming into Monday morning, so I'm really happy. Um, yeah, that's it. That's me. I'm gonna have some. I haven't drank any water today. It's filled up up there. I can see it, a whole big bloody tub of water. So that's what I'm going to do. Um, yeah, I'll let you go. I'll speak later. Just coming on with my super greasy, awful hair. I'm having a cup of tea. And I'm going to school run in a minute. It's 10 to 3. I'm just freezing, actually, is what I am. Is anyone on this diet freezing? It's cold, isn't it? I don't know why you get that. It's a side effect of this diet, is you get cold. So I'm free. I've still got my big fat jumper on today, but my feet are still cold. I don't want to go out on the school run because it looks a bit rainy out there. I'd rather just drive up, but I do try and um, walk up with the baby in the pushchair. Because you know what, if I park, I've got to get him out of the car. Or, uh, all that's just a big rigmarole anyway. My cat's running around. You know, when you think, what have they got? <laughs> you wake up and there's a bloody mouse or something in the kitchen. So, yeah. I don't want to put him in the car because then I have to get him out the other end and carry him around. So I don't want to put the pushchair in the car. So it is easy to walk up, but I don't want to walk up because it's freezing. Can't win, can I? I might warm up in a, I might warm up when I've, I'm out of breath walking up that hill. So that was it. Only popped on Sam, having a cup of tea. Cheers. Hey. Chicken noodle soup. And I'm perching on the edge of the sofa. So I can't eat it while I'm videoing. You want to say hello? Hi. <laughs> no. I'm just telling you... Um, I'm having chicken noodle soup and it's four o'clock. These that are eating like Nutella on a wrap and... And an apple. Oh no, he's eating an apple actually. There you go. We've got the heads up here, an apple. He's got Nutella around his face. So I'm having my chicken noodle soup because it's cold and rainy. And I'm going before they knock me off with it all. 
Okay, um, I just thought I'd redo uh, mac and cheese on a video, um, just in case people haven't seen it. So I've put, what does it say on the back here? 160 to 180 mil of water. I always go for the higher amount. Um, I don't encourage, but with the food, I'll go for the higher amount because the way I think it works best is if you leave it after the microwave for a little bit. So don't get it straight out the microwave and eat it. The pesto and the mo and the mac and cheese are a bit um, a bit hard when they come out of the microwave, like they haven't it hasn't soaked in. I'm just going to show you what it looks like and how I make it. So this is my mac and cheese. So I've just opened it up and I put it in the water. I'm just using a microwaveable bowl. Obviously, with the spag bowl, you can't use a little bowl like this. It's a microwave one. You need to use a big jug because the spag bowl got a home in there. Put over the top. So I'm just giving it a mix up, okay? It's very appetising right now. Right. So I'm going to put it in the microwave for two minutes. Then I'm going to stir it and put it in the microwave for two minutes again, okay? All right. So two minutes, uh, stir, two minutes, stir. This is how it comes out. Actually, I'm going to turn the, the um, thing on. So this is what it looks like at first, okay? Oh, steaming up. Steaming up. Right, that's how it looks like at first. So I'm going to leave it. I'm just going to show you what it's like in 10 minutes. Okay, so I'm, t I'm actually 11 minutes in. So... It's got a bit of skin on it because it's hot. Hang on, I'll do this. Hang on a minute. Right. See the consistency after 10 minutes or 11 minutes. Let me get my camera straight. So, obviously, it's just gone a bit cold. So, I'm going to whack it in the microwave again. I don't know if that's legal or not, but I'm going to do it because it's too cold. Let's see. Obviously, you can have it a bit less watery, but it's definitely soaked up loads of that water. I'm going to whack it in the microwave for another. I'm going to do 30 seconds. I'll see what happens. Okay, here we are. What I did one minute in the microwave. Give it a little stir. Right, how's about that then? Loads better, isn't it? all soft every piece of it is soft definitely leave it 10 minutes all the juice sort of soaked up you know one last little touch a bit of golden veg give it a little sprinkle on Seasoned, yum yum. Hi, now I'm eating it. Yummy. It's hot, so I'll put it back in the microwave. I don't know if there's any rules around that. I've never been told to not microwave it extra. But it gets cold when you eat it for 10 minutes, and you can only eat it after you've left it. And it's better hot in it. So, I'm eating my yummy mac and cheese. Um, I've drank this much water. Jonathan stopped at his brother's another night. Got my cup of tea, mac and cheese, the rest of my water. Corrie's on. Kids are in bed. Pat lunches are made. Washing's doing. Dishwasher's on and loaded and on. Did maths homework. We did reading. We did spellings. Really productive day, but I've just sat down. However, it's only five to nine. So that's a win, win, win for me. Five to nine. Well, happy. I'm going to enjoy this and I'll see you later.